Hey guys, this is going to be another quick Linux command video. Check the link in the description for more info and for copy and paste examples. All right, so let's talk about the uh, Linux FG command. So Linux command FG is used to bring a background process into the foreground, right? So um, right here we can see we have a bunch of things run jobs. We see a bunch of jobs in the background. Now if we want, we could put another one in the background. Control Z, there we go, jobs. We have a bunch of commands running in the background. It's H top and top. So if you bring them to the foreground, they're immediately gonna show, you know, they're gonna start showing us output. They're gonna start running and showing us output. So if you wanna bring one of these to the foreground, let's say number five, so job ID five, you can say FG modulus five. So that's ID five. That will bring this, this job, which is top to the foreground. There we go. For top is now in the foreground. We see the top command running as it normally would. Now um, I'm gonna put that back in the background. And let's say if you want to. Uh, so plus is the current. This is the current job. This is the previous job. So you want to bring the current job to the foreground. We could have said plus for the current job and bring it to the foreground. So the other thing we can do, you can basically you can speci specify these with a job spec. So jobs. So say if we want to bring, um, you know, say if you want to bring H top to the foreground, you can search for any job with the with H top um, has to be non ambiguous, and you can bring that to the foreground right there. However, if we try to bring top to the foreground it's ambiguous because it doesn't know which one of these top commands you're referring to. So um, yeah, that there's that and check the link in the description for more on job specs. So that's basically how the FG command works. Remember to check out my BG command video and also my job, my video on the jobs command and really the, the jobs command, the FG command and the BG command go together. I have a yet another video that covers them all together. I'm basically just making this video to make sure I have, you know, a video for every Linux command there is. So yeah, check out my other videos. And that's, that's it for the FG command for today. Remember, check the links in the description for more info. Hit the subscribe button for more useful content like this. We also have a ton of other more interesting content covering things like coding, hardware, software, servers, Raspberry Pis, 3D printing, and a whole lot more. Hopefully you found this useful. Thanks for watching and we'll see you guys on that next video.